Welcome to the Arduino Project Tilt Switch. For this project, you will need the following. A tilt switch, which is otherwise known as a ball switch, and two wires, male to female, red and black. If you like the channel, subscribe. And if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. This is what the tilt switch looks like. And as you can see, there is not a positive or negative on the tilt switch. Install a red wire on one side of the tilt switch. Now install a black wire on the other side of the tilt switch. On the Arduino, hook a red wire to pin 2 and hook a black wire to the ground pin of the Arduino. Now let's add some code. Before the setup, we need to put a constant. So type constant and it's an integer. And we're going to call that LED pin and that is 13. In the setup, put the following. Pin mode, LED pin, comma, and then put that as an output. Put the semicolon and put another line. Pin mode, LED pin, or two excuse me, comma, input. The second pin is the input. And now we put, we're gonna to write to it, digital write, to pin two, we're going to start it as high and put the semicolon. Now let's go to the loop. In the loop, we're going to make an integer called digital value or digital val, which is equal to, we're going to read digital read pin two, put the semicolon. So now we need to make a decision. If that is high, if the digital val is high, which means it's on, we're going to make two decisions. The first one we're going to put is we're going to write to the LED pin. We're going to put it low. Which we're going to turn off the LED. We're going to add another part of an if statement called an else. So if anything else, we do a digital write to pin 13, which is LED pin, as high. In this case, we turn on the LED. So if you need to look at the code, I will zoom it out and you can pause the video and take a look at the code. We now send the code to the Arduino and now we tilt the switch. When it's down, the LED's off. Now the LED goes on. So when you turn it, the LED goes off and then you tilt it and the LED goes on. If you like this project, Subscribe to the channel and also give us a thumbs up and leave us a comment if you found any other device that you have hooked up. And remember, the most important thing is to keep on learning and have fun with the Arduino.